Hello everyone. I wanted to keep the style of this video a little bit different. I don't think a lot of uh, my viewers are actually enjoying the cinematic editing and uh, B-rolls and uh, time lapses which I normally do. Okay. So even that that makes sense actually because uh, we are all droppers and we are not looking for flashy edits and stuff right now. What we want right now is complete raw content, okay? And I wanted to keep the style of this video like this. So in this video, I wanted to talk about um, how important it is to actually have doubts. We all know that GE means is almost uh, six months away. And basically, when you're studying for something like GE, especially advanced, uh, you need to make sure that you're learning things not just for the sake of it. You're actually learning it at the depth. Okay, you're actually learning it from the roots, and it's extremely important. Like. This one mistake I made in my last year actually made me cost J. And that's the exact point that I'm trying to make in this video. Okay. I want to stress and emphasize on how important it is to actually have doubts. Okay. Like whenever I'm learning a new concept right now, I actually uh, do two things. Okay. One thing is that I try to enact as a student who is asking a doubt. And the next thing I do is to... Uh, act like a teacher who is solving the doubt that way like i concepts actually become way stronger this is what i'm trying to say whenever you're studying especially physics and organic chemistry okay you need to like make sure your doubts are cleared at the root okay and that's extremely important also when it comes to physics physics j mains and j advance are completely different i hope you guys know this and even if you're preparing for mains i would say you should learn everything at the roots. Even if uh, in your class the teacher is doing an illustration which is advanced level, you should be, you should not skip it at all. Okay, you should actually try and understand the concepts clearly. Okay, it might be that J means twenty twenty six comes even difficult than last time. Okay, that's and we are droppers. Okay, and it would be our last chance. So it's best to not take any chances. Okay. <laughs> If you get what I'm trying to say. And also, since we're online students, getting our doubts cleared is actually a bit difficult task, right? So I wanted to tell you how I get my doubts cleared. I use Philo app for this. Okay, I get connected to a real tutor under like 60 seconds. And they actually explain it in step by step. Just like a teacher would explain on the board without making you feel stupid. That's actually very important, okay? And it's not just limited to one subject. Physics, chemistry, maths, everything is covered. And there are sometimes when you might feel that, yeah, I don't want to talk to someone over call. There are also smart AI features, graphs, diagrams, numericals. It handles everything very well. You can also use Philo for short notes and mocks, you know. And also in Philo, you also get a three-step verification. And so you can actually have accurate solutions to your doubts. And the mock tests are free as well. The point I'm trying to make is that Obviously, I don't want myself and the people who are listening to me to make the same mistake again, right? I wanted to tell all of you that solving your doubts is as important as doing question practice. Because just uh, learning formulas and doing some uh, basic easy easy questions, they might give you instant gratification. Like, and it might make you feel good, but it's not the correct way at all, okay? You need to keep leveling up. Understanding things at the basic level is important extremely important so basically that's all i had to say like you can use philo if you want the link is in the description so keep going keep grinding we're in this together bye bye